Wait, I'm sorry, my name. Pleased to meet you. Uh, you were a friend of Patrick's. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. oh, he was a very unusual friend to me. But boy, you have to look forward to our time together. Oh, that's nice. Uh, if Patrick did have a place for everybody in his heart. Yes, and we would meet once a week. And he would piss me the fuck off, too. Oh, I mean, we would conversate about religion. Well, he didn't like the word religion, he used spirituality. But he was trying to convince me to be more like his religion. Oh, well, we're Catholic. Oh, yes. He told me about his mama. He said you hadn't been in church in over 20 years ago, and you still insist that you were well, I did too. No worries, baby. He said you deserved to call yourself that just because you had spent so many years being beaten by those lesbians. No. <laughs>
stuff from anything we do. After all, God created everything, right? So why would he excuse himself? <laughs> Especially from the parts. You know what I mean, right? Bible thumping. I think I know what was hung from right. First of all, in Leviticus it says, men shall not lie with men. Of course, he had an answer for that too. You say, well, didn't Jesus come to wipe away the Old Testament? So I told him, mm -mm, honey, the word of God changes not. <laughs> Which means the word of God don't change. <laughs> and you know what he had the balls to tell me? Mm -hmm. Well, he said, all the Bible stuff is just meant to put stupid people in line. I mean, if you expect me to believe that people back then was more stupid than they are today, 